Patrick Queen, biggest free agent deal. Hope we get the same type of return on that investment too. You see, he's talking more shit. I did, <laughs> I did, bro. How'd you feel? Uh, <laughs> huh? <laughs> you know, he's a little bit more established than a JPJ. <laughs> And he plays a different position. Yeah. He plays it's linebacker. very different, bro. The it, expectations, it what you're exposed to, it's, it's different, man. Yeah, yeah. So mm-hmm. I, I don't mind it as much. It's yeah. Steelers-Ravens. It's yeah. him pretty much just straight up calling out the Ravens. Mm-hmm. And yeah, I think that linebacker position, I think it, it, it just bodes bodes better well for some shit talking yeah. than a cornerback. Because typically, worst case, he could big hit somebody and it's going to just have a different vibe. Even if he got burnt the play before, a big hit changes everything. That corner spot, you know it's just a different life out there, man. Like, it's less forgiving. A mistake out there is catastrophic. I, I think it's a lot more mental, too. Yeah, it definitely is, man. Because you're the man on the moon. You're. It's like, it's almost very similar to golf in the sense of, that's pass or fill. You don't got help when that deep ball is out there 60 yards down field and it's dropping. You're either going to make the play or you're not going to make the play. And we all see you. We all are either going to be walking down to where you're at or we're going to be clapping as you're coming back to where we're at. But it's usually a bad scenario if we got to go to you. And, you know, for them dudes, man, it weighs on them. You want me to get the quotes? Uh-oh. Talk that spicy talk. Come on, man. Give me that spicy P queen talk, man. I like what I heard. He says it's a better atmosphere here mm-hmm. for me. Mm-hmm. Everybody is cool. The people are cool. Shout the out. players are cool. Shout the food out. spots are better. Talk that talk. I'm more talk of a true talk. food guy rather than a seafood guy. It's just a better atmosphere oh, for me here. He just took a shot at the whole food propaganda. He said, I'm tired of y'all talking about this Maryland, these crabs. I'm tired of y'all talking about crab cakes and all that, bro. He ain't on none of that. He said he don't even like Obey. That's what he told me. He don't even like the Obey. Now, Shout what's out. the deal with Louisiana? Is that, that, is that more seafood? Cause that's like where he grew up once so LSU. So what is Cajun? So okay. think of it like in, in less of just focal point of seafood. Think more on the spice, and that's like the Louisiana thing. Whether it's Louisiana fried chicken, it's gonna have a little bit more kick. Louisiana style mashed potatoes and gravy has got a little bit more kick. The shrimp, the seafood. So that's the Louisiana part. It's the seasoning on that thing. Yeah, Creole baby, come on now, yeah. Okay. Mm-hmm. So that's what that is. But I like the fact that he taking shots at the whole organization, the city, everything. I'm like, bro, if you're going to do it, do it, bro. Do it. Because we do need that type of energy. Now, I will say, Atlanta Roberts has the same energy. He just isn't as vocal. And they both got very similar mindsets. And that's what I love about just both of those dynamics right there. Because they both going to back that up. And they physical as heck, man. It's going to be some pass popping. It's going to be some pass popping. We need to get to that week, man. That's going to be a fun one. Let's be a phone one. Uh, well, it's going to be a while till we get I to that know, week. Bro. I know, bro. Yeah, we got 13, 14 games before we get to that, man. But it's then it's a quick week turnaround. Week 11. I don't know that specific game. Our, our first AFC North game is week 11. It might right. be the Ravens. Is the Ravens are bang? We, we play four in a row. Yeah, I'm about to say. Off. That's why I was like, it's week 13, 14. It's in that time frame, like, by week included, obviously. Like, the NFL week, not our week yet. But yeah, man. He also says he doesn't care what... People think it's the truth. I'm not saying anything bad about them. I'm just speaking the truth. Talk, yo. T- he's, I'm just in my truth, bro. Hey, he said they seafood overrated. He said that Obey ain't hitting. He said the Obey tastes old. That's what he said. All right. And he said crab cakes is super duper overrated, man. Super overrated. So I like him, bro. Shout out. He said I like just food in general, not just that. Where well, your diversity at? Shout out to Pittsburgh, man. If you know, you know, bro. Like, it. hold on. I wanted to read one more comment he had about said he, he actually had a tweet he about to make me want to fire or something yeah man god dog man we did do the steak tacos the other day deep man i grilled the steak up sliced it up man hey man that might shout out man shout out i like your energy patrick queen i like your energy okay yeah yeah he tweets out i don't know who this is exactly directed to oh yeah what is that all right he says this uh, oh, this actually this is a long this is a this is a while ago. This is from May third, but shout out to Al Bundy though. Maybe I guess it has some relation to what we're talking we're gonna about. Go with it on this that. Is, we're gonna go with it. Yeah, this is I think initially when he signed here, a bunch mm-hmm. of Ravens fans getting on Patrick Queen for going to a rival. But yeah. here's what he said. Y'all funny if you think I'm pressed. Y'all was on my ass because you know what I can do against you. I love arguing so you never get under my skin. And at the end of the day, y'all uh, Abby be famous people because y'all never amounted to... Okay, y'all average... Wait, what is this? 
y'all Avi be famous people because y'all never amounted to anything in life. If you want to chat, hop on my stream. Going up in a few. Hey, bro. He just shot at the fans and everybody. He say, look, bro. Y'all ain't gonna never done it anyway. That's why y'all here hating on me anyways. Hop on my stream, though. I like it. A little promotion at the end. Salute. <laughs> Salute. Salute. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so uh, I like it. I don't like JPJ doing it, but I like <laughs> I like this. Why are we on agree? Why are we agreeing with that? I was like, I didn't feel as good about the JPJ one, but I do love this energy right here. I love it. Talk your talk, and because of him coming from Baltimore, like that was your spot where they took you. You was you was doing your thing, and it's like, hey, let him know it's really good, man. Now yeah. that also means flip side, Roquan Smith is going to be turned all the way up to prove that he is the best linebacker when we play them. So we just got to make sure that we know what that means as well. And we ain't ducking no smoke, but just the cause and effect of it. Yeah. Because it definitely go both ways. 